Should packing for college include a gun? That is right. The long-fought battle for concealed weapons on campuses is being reunited here, reignited in Georgia because of a recent spike in crime at Georgia Tech. Joining us to talk about it is a young man leading the effort for guns on campus, Robert Eager. He is president and treasurer of Tech's Marksmanship Club. Uh, Robert, good to see you. Good to have you on here. Well, give thanks us, for having me. Give us a sense of why you feel so strongly about this issue. We've seen the violent crimes against students escalate on Georgia Tech's campus over the course of the last three years. Initially entering the campus, we knew it would be unsafe in the surrounding neighborhoods that are considered high crime areas, but stepping foot on campus was considered safe. And especially last week with the robbery of a student inside of his apartment building, we feel that students should have the right to protect themselves on campus just as they do anywhere else. Does it worry you that there are many different studies that show if you weapon, if you put a weapon in hands of folks who don't know how to use them, and you they face a criminal, that person is going to take it away from you and it ends up that it's going to be more dangerous for you than it is for the person attacking you. Yes, if the person doesn't understand how to use their weapon. We encourage them to get training to go through the licensing requirements here, which require a background check in the state of Georgia and other licensing requirements to acquire that weapon legally and then learn how to use it. And it's not always the best time to take out your weapon in case you're being mugged. It's only when you're at risk of your personal well-being or something you consider extremely important to your survival that you should use a gun as a last resort. Uh, I want to show our viewers here how it looks across the country because Georgia is one of the uh, 22 states that ban carrying a concealed weapon on campus. Uh, the gun laws among the more lenient of the nation, but uh, Georgia lawmakers themselves don't necessarily believe that it's going to make uh, students uh, safer. They, they believe that this is actually more dangerous in terms of putting weapons in the hands of students. Well, clear, clearly being more dangerous is something we're not expecting to happen. We've seen at all University of Utah state schools uh, that have allowed carry since 2006, not a single incident has occurred with a licensed weapons holder doing something illegal with his gun on campus. People are capable of doing it safely in over six states that have allowed colleges the option to carry on 200 different campuses. What do you think of this? We've got a statement from Georgia Tech that says it follows state law, uh, the, the state law and Board of Region policy that most colleges suggest that students travel in groups, that they watch out for their surroundings, that these are the kinds of common sense security measures uh, that will prevent students from, from being attacked, that they don't need to weaponize themselves. We definitely agree and common sense safety measures are necessary while on campus. We've seen people ignore those entirely and get robbed. That's something that is critical to their safety. However, we've now seen cases where people were walking in groups, noticed suspicious people behind them and tried to get away but were unable to do so. Or in their apartment on campus were mugged at night while they're sleeping. There's no way to get away from that if they're be able to breach that many layers of security. What is your next move? I know that you've got a Facebook page. There are a lot of people who are liking what you are doing now. How do you get Georgia to, to change, to actually change its law? We're working right now with some state legislatures as well as Georgia Carry to draft legislation that allow carry on campus. We've also been talking to incoming students of the freshman class and their parents at all of our freshman orientation sessions and work to speak with the general population on campus. We're scheduling an opening meeting to offer information about that in August and we'll hopefully have a debate with the administration or at least with other individuals on campus who are concerned since the administration has simply told us they're following state law and don't want to comment further. Have you, have you been, have you faced an attack? Have you been attacked personally yourself? Is this something that, that affects you personally? Not on Georgia Tech's campus. I've been approached off campus at knife point in Atlanta before, happened to be in front of an Atlanta Police Department cruiser, so I happened to be safe in that case, but criminals weren't terribly observant at all of their environment or what risks were posed to them in this case. But it's not something that's affected me on campus so much as my concern for my safety and that the safety of others. All right. Thank you for joining us. I appreciate it. Thank you very much.